Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Mountain Blade Warband. Man, that music cue is uh, perfect there. Uh, where we left off, I know we had a pretty bad fight recently at one of the castles. Where we won it in the end, but I'm pretty sure we actually lost a lot of people. How's my party looking? Yeah, it's looking a lot more thin than it used to. I'm a little bit worried about that. We need to sell some prisoners. I actually wouldn't mind recruiting this camp defender. Uh, it's uh, camp. Uh, take an action for prisoners in your party. He accepts the offer. I wouldn't mind having him actually. Mm. I think it hurts the morale of the party though, doesn't it? I'm gonna say yes. Three morale? Damn. Anyone else? No, I can't even ask again. I was gonna hope that the camp defender would join us. Alright, do we have any quests? No. Yeah, the moral damage is very small. And we're at war with the Nords now, aren't we? Which makes it hard to train up here. Let's just remind ourselves of what wars we're in. We are at war with the Khanite and the Nords. I wish we'd finish off the Khanite, but our Marshal is just useless. I know we took another castle recently, but I think we lost it, didn't we? Didn't we take this castle and then lose it right away or something? Because we didn't defend it because our Marshal's useless and didn't order us to? Oh, that's brutal. Interesting that we actually share a border with the uh, the Nords right over here. In fact, where am I? I'm over here? I'm gonna go day trip up there. What do I see? I want to see if I can get like a guard or um, a lord off guard up here. How many are at the castle? They do have a party there. Wow, this is easy pickings. That's very few troops. I wish I were the marshal. If I were the marshal, I would just say, let's hit this immediately and nip it in the bud. But uh, I don't think our marshal's going to prioritize this. Damn. Made it to another stream. Hey, Doodle Noodle. Yeah, party spotted by the castle. That's fine. In our inventory, we're good on food. <coughs> hey, Myrtles. Again, probably a little bit of a short stream today just because I got so much other stuff to work on. And I'm 14 days into being sick. Oh, wow. Oh, that guy is fucked. Oh, no, he's way faster than them. Never mind. He's going to get away. Man, that's a shame. Who's our marshal again? Talk to me, Hakeem. God, he went like, oh, tournament. Well, we basically start and end every stream with a tournament, don't we? May as well start this one with a, with a, uh, with a tournament. Okay, let's just make sure that we remember who our dude is. Uh, I would like to ask location. Our marshal is uh, Addis, Adis? Is he in here? No? Okay. If you have a good amount of a relationship with a lord, you could just ask him to follow you or go to the castle you want and siege it. Um, I don't think I have a particularly good relationship with anyone other than whoever the old marshal was. I think he liked me. Right, Hakim is the Sultan. Hey Sultan, um, you want to give me like a castle or something? Did we recently take anything? Can you fetch for me? Nine. That's not bad. I'm so tempted to just, just ask to be released from my oath. But I have probably almost no right to rule. Hey Jetstream, do me a favor. Look up right to rule on the wikia. Remind me of how I can get some. I know I can get my companions to basically sponsor me. And that'll get me some. I know getting married will help a lot. In fact, that's what I should do now, is I should try and get married. Um, so I should hit up some feasts. I should also spend some money at taverns learning poems.
Um, course of action. Follow me. <sighs> All right. Fortress can be easily taken. It's, uh, I forget the name of it. <laughs> Let me double check the name. Uh, if I'm on the right, your kingdom goes to peace. Um, when your kingdom goes to peace, you'll get some right tool. Interesting. Jam. All right, we're hit. We're we're pumping up the jam, everybody. I I do run pretty slow. I kind of want a little bit of athletics points, but I wouldn't use it that often. Probably not often enough to make it worth it. Course of action. Fortress can easily be taken. This could take jam. Come on. Is the feast really more important than winning the war? You're the worst. I hate you. I hate this country. Alright, I'm going to the tournament. Need a warm up. Uh, I am on horseback. Ah, no. And I have javelins. Fuck, this sucks. Is it a bunch of two and twos? No, it's three and threes. I have like no throwing skill. Oh, this sucks. Look at that spread. I'm not hitting shit like this. Stab him. Can I have your lance? Sweet. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Now, well, they're all over there. I'm taking the lance and getting back on my horse. Yeah! Uh, Game where it gives you a little bit of right to rule. Yeah, I want to. I want to do that then. Go took out his horse. Go. Fuck. One of our guys got dehorsed. Okay, before you become a problem. Yeah, block that. There we go. And I wait. Here we go. Got him. All right, we've got this one now. Nope. All right, round one done. That was a slow round. Asking for your, uh, either than getting married and asking your fans for support, there's no way to gain right to rule until you become the ruler of your own country. Okay, I need to do everything I can to get right of rule before I become a ruler, or else I'm just gonna have mass war declarations on me, because they're basically gonna look at me as a bandit lord. As illegitimate. Oh fuck, it's just two big factions? Okay, just charge then. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I took some really bad damage there right off the bat. Fucking... Sweet, he's down. Yeah! Double horse kills. Okay. I gotta get some backstabs here while I can. Ooh, I got low health though. This is dangerous. I'm mostly just trying to take a lot of people off their horses right now. <laughs> Thankfully, I can maneuver a lot better than they can. I've got really high riding skill. Nope. Fuck. Oh, this is over. Nope. Yeah, this isn't happening. Oh, that sucks. 
Well, that was one of the worst tournaments I've done. <laughs> you remember when I won like five tournaments in a row? That was great. Keep killing horses, are you sure it doesn't work for Tesco? I don't even get that reference. Can I run him? I'm the same speed as him. If I could take out that lord, that'd be real good. He keeps making dumb turns. I'm totally gonna get him. He's extremely slightly faster than me. I got him. I'll say this only once. Surrender or die. Alright. Time to get some fucking renown. We have them outnumbered. Fight in the desert. This is better for him than it is for me. He actually has some mounted units. Interesting. So he does have some foreign troops. At least I think I see horses in the distance. Alright, he's taking his hill. I've got my hill. What's he gonna do? He does have a lot of horses. Okay. Interesting. Alright. Fight defensively. I'll let him slam into my wall of infantry. Because I'm going to win an archery fight if he tries to outlast me. He keeps advancing bit by bit. The second he gets close enough that my dudes start throwing axes at him, he's not going to be happy. <laughs> yep, my dudes are starting to pull the javelins and axes now. Okay, archers can't see very well at this angle. Archers advance 20 paces. Alright, here comes! I dehorsed some guy off a charger, that's pretty good. They've got hired blades, so I gotta be careful. Hi, easy target! Nope. Nope. My horse is a lot tankier than his. Oh, one of my guys leveled. Whoo! He hit me hard. Interesting that this Nord has so many Kanite. Is this guy a Kanite and I just didn't notice? I could have sworn he was blue. Don't you run? I think this is Conite. Infantry and cavalry charge. Tips to make your towns make more money? You just need to upgrade them a lot. It sucks. Because if they get looted, their prosperity goes all the way down. Fuck you. I'm gonna get this guy because he might actually be a lord. Got him. It was a Lancer. Okay. Massacre. Who are good archers? <coughs> <coughs> the Vagaris have the best foot archers. Uh, the Saren had a pretty good foot archers. And um, the best foot crossbowmen are the Rodoks. Rodok sharps, sh sharpshooters and um, Vagar master archers are consider like the two best archer classes. Alright, who'd I lose? Uh, mercenary swordsman, that's not horrible. And the rest are just wounded. Okay. I We did take out the Jarl. See, that's this is a weird thing. It's a Jarl. He doesn't have a single Nordic troop. It's almost all Kanite. Weird. He managed to escape? Come on! We knocked him out and killed his whole army! Damn. Okay, some farmers we can hire. I'm cool with that. Well, we probably got some really good armor. Mm, not as good as mine, really. Okay. Got another horse. I'm not gonna catch him. His speed's so high because it's just one guy. <sighs> Alright. 
was it you that leveled up? He's intelligence because he is trainer. That's right. Trainer and he may as well just have some combat stuff on the side, probably. Yeah, combat stuff. Uh, shield's good. His, <coughs> his weapon master is good. Uh, I wouldn't mind giving him a horse, actually. I could use a really good cavalry to use as basically a bodyguard. So I think that's what I'll do. Um, let's give him riding. Yeah. Give him riding. And... We don't need a backup tracker. Ah, uh, there's nothing else really that useful he could take. This game looks complicated? It's not really. It's just you're coming in like 11 streams in. I guess athletics. In case he gets uh, knocked off of his horse. Uh, was I holding off his skill for a reason? No, he just leveled up. Okay, I'll give him more shield. And I will give him... Uh... Oh, right, he only has the one point because it wasn't intelligence. All right, uh, Borcha. Right, I was holding on to his point for the next level up. Any tips for fighting on horseback? Oh, fighting on horseback is a lot better than fighting on foot. Um, <clears throat> you're way tankier because you have this whole thing protecting you of a horse. Uh, you're more mobile than them, especially if you have high riding skill, which I highly recommend. If you look here, like I dump a lot in agility because my riding skill is seven. I can have the slowest and least maneuverable of Charger and still completely outmaneuver anyone on the ground. This looks complicated uh, due to all the text. Yeah, as when you maybe steps your way up, though, when you first start playing, of course. Like, I'm in the actual military of a country, so it's more advanced. You don't start off that way. And I want to become a king. There's another tournament. Alright, uh, sell stuff. Don't need any of that. But I do need the money. Uh... Who's in the feast now? I do suck on horseback though? Then you just need to practice. It's not that hard. Alright. Uh, we need our character to marry somebody. Because that will give us more right to rule. Uh, we have the honor of knowing more about you. Okay, so we need to befriend that person. Or else there's a chance he won't approve of it. Okay. Uh, lack him. Where is he? Uh, am I blind? Oh, right here. Harris, isn't that where I am? Is it the guy next to you? Yup. <laughs> oh, he doesn't have a high opinion of me. Okay. Not happening. Gotta find somebody who already has a high opinion of me. That'll make it way easier. And while we're here, Tavern. Make sure that the family is upstanding and good natured. Good personalities. Um, good, pers uh, good personality to have when you're a marshal or king. How do I tell what their personality is? I actually don't know how to check. You know three hill poems, so you're cool. I don't remember a whole lot of poetry, like, in real life. Uh, I used to be decently big into it in high school. Don't remember a whole lot. I remember more sing-songy ones, you know? Mirzy dotes and dozy dotes and little lambsy divey, killy divey too, wouldn't you? Stuff like that. That's what I remember. Because that's fun to say. It's also a good party trick because it sounds like absolute gibberish to people who haven't taken the time to learn it. Notes and search for the characters the trace should be there. Really? I was unaware. How do I, how have I never noticed that? Let me just, uh, character. Some random person. You. Um, controversy zero. We're down... Hmm. What's it to say on that page? Uh, in search for the character, the trait should be on there. At least it's there on most mods. Oh, well, there you go. It's not. It's not a base game thing.
Uh, right. I need to find a slave trader. There's still so many desert bandits over here. There must be another desert bandit hideout. That or no one's gone around to clean it up. Oh, Wandering Minstrel. We needed to find one of them. Okay, um, teach me a poem. And his brave but rough warrior when the hearts of his lady, blah, blah, blah. Uh, 300 dinars, not bad. He's about to find uh, out as there are days of kingship. I believe that they say kingship and lordship should be used to keep peace and prevent war uh, against all, yet not be blind to the, impo the possibility of injustice. Uh, are... Sorry, uh, it, you talked again, then the whole thing shift and I lost my place. Um, not blind to the possibility of injustice. Uh, they are upstanding, good natured. They are. Well, you should keep your faith promises of justice. Sometimes it's hard to balance those sticks with people you trust with. I mean, no good. Okay, so what you're telling me is they'll say that huge, enormous quote if they're good? Or something? I don't know. Like, I got totally lost during that. That's an enormous quote in a really, like, unpunctuated block because of the bad formatting of a chat room. We could take them out really easy. Let's just take them out to clean this up a little bit, because I bet you the wealth of this area is really poor because of all these bandits. They're probably hitting caravans. Our medic just leveled up. Go to the Lord and do let me ask you questions and you'll see. Okay. Now, some of the poetry is worse since, uh, we made these by heart. Uh, it's completely Irish. So you don't know what it means, but you can sing it. Nobody speaks Irish. That's the thing. Sometimes Irish people just make noises and say they're speaking Irish to seem cool. <laughs> I love the idea of that actually being true. Of which there's no possible way it is. Actually, you know what? Some people are petty enough to use that to try and seem cool. I'm not even afraid. They're throwing rocks at me. I'm just gonna cleave through them. Let's see what happens if I go in the middle and just start swinging. Oh, that's satisfying. This is a massacre. That was fun. Oh wait, there's still one going. We did it! <laughs> that was not a fair fight. Oh, your casualties, none. Enemy casualties, 21 killed. Oh, that was not a fair fight. I love it. Gonna get almost no money selling this garbage that they have, though. Whatever, we probably saved a caravan and was gonna get waylaid by them. A super mustache, Bika. Alright. Do we have anyone that I can just... Come on, Ransom Broker, please. Okay, you. You can teach me a poem. Yes, teach me a poem. Thank you. Trying to build up my base of poetry. Is there a Star Wars mod for Warband? Yes, there is for base game Warband, and it's quite good. I played it a very long time ago, though, so it's probably better now. Assuming it's still in active de development, which I'm not sure if it is. It's not Warband, though. It's, like, base game. Is there a chud in this game? No, this is not real history. Alright, um... I would kill to just move up and start hitting this whole plane's the steps hard. Uh, 
Marshall is so useless. Why is he not blasting the Khanite? They're almost dead. We can finish them. Take all their lands. Look, we took three cities from them. They have one city left. The rest are like little villages and castles. They have one city. We could blast that Zard. We got their capital. We own their capital. And we haven't even taken most of their, their castles. We should take their castles. We'd have control of more villages and get more natural resources and have a more robust industry and economy. Ah, God, our, our king and our marshal are idiots. I'd love to be in charge of this country. <sighs> All right. Oh yeah, by the way, I got uh, a tad report uh, on yesterday. Yeah, I got a tad report on yesterday that was catching up on those weeks that were missed uh, while the company was reworking stuff. So I got this flood of messages from people who used uh, tad on browser. I think I'm going to make a whole section where I, I read off a bunch of those on the weekly vlog, because that's a lot of fun. So I, I skimmed through a lot, and I was like, no, I gotta, I gotta save this for a vlog. So I'm going to wait until Monday. Like, next Monday, obviously. Tavern! Did I check this one already? <laughs> I did. Hmm. All right. I'm going to patrol around uh, Halmar a bit. Yeah, I'm going to patrol around Halmar a little bit. I want a footman. Uh, higher blades, fuck yes, higher blades are incredible. And I'm going to try and pick off like a weak lord. It's not easy against the Khanite though, because the Khanite... Uh, use almost entirely cavalry armies, so they move very quickly. So he can outrun me if I outnumber him. And so, you know, upstanding good-natured lords are less likely to defect. Don't get a penalty or a big penalty from not getting land when you capture new land. King. Uh, as more likely to answer your call to marshal. Yeah. Isn't it I should be... Um... What is it? I should be making friends with lords in the army that I'm in, like good-natured lords, because I can get them to defect to my army. I should probably do that more. So he doesn't have a strong opinion on me, although it is a little positive. Um, I want to ask you something. Um, hmm. So how do I learn about this guy? What's the realm doing? Taking aim at a castle. Well, our marshal hasn't said anything yet. Why aren't you... Oh. Never mind. Uh, I hope you read my message. Oh, did I miss... Did I miss it? Sorry, I probably missed it. I don't see it. It might have scrolled off. Uh, what are you and your men doing? They're scouting. Okay. Uh, discuss with you in private? Oh. Do I need to discuss with them in private to learn about their motives? Maybe. That's a Vega Caravan. Okay. 37 deserters. That's a huge group of uh, skirmishers. Prisoners, manhunters. I wouldn't mind hiring seven manhunters. Ooh. Oh, on Tad. Okay, yeah, I'll read it. Do I want to fight them? I think I want to fight them. Are they running? They're running. Are we faster? We are. Okay. Let's play it safe. We are going through enemy lands. Sweet, this should be a good fight. I think we're in open plains right now, so I don't know how well that's going to go. They are more reliant on cavalry than we are. Uh, I'm cool with defending right here. There we go. Which way are they facing? That way. Oh, there's the enemy! Alright, we're doing this! 
Ooh. Whoa. Back off, back off. Get to our infantry. Let the wall help. Ooh, these guys are not that strong. This is good. Hey, get away from my archers. I can almost one-shot their horses. This is great. Oh, one of my guys got knocked out. I'm fine with my dudes getting knocked out as long as they don't get killed. Oh, a bunch of them are running away. Yeah. Telling the cavalry to charge. Get back here. Ah, he's gonna escape if... Yeah, he's escaping. Damn. Yeah! Fuck that guy, he thought he was gonna get out of here. Get over here. Anyone left? Someone? It's over. They must have gotten away. Another way to know for sure uh, is when you capture a lord, they'll say, I yield, do yourself credit, and grant me honors of war as benefiting my rank. Congratulations on your victor. Okay, so if they congratulate me for defeating them in combat, it's another way to know they're good natured? Okay. Uh, the conversation text is maybe people not in your faction because it should go. Uh, what do you think in general terms of the kings and lords? Weird. Alright. So I had one of my dudes get knocked out, otherwise I slaughtered them. Sweet. I have ten prisoners, which is my current limit, which is fine. Well, that was a massacre. I didn't think that one was going to be quite as easy. Alright, let's go sell at Durham. Alright, I forgot he leveled up earlier, and he's our surgeon, so I really want him leveling up. Alright, and I can upgrade my watchman to caravan guards. Sweet. How do you get more villages? Uh, befriend your king. That's the best way to do it. Uh, the more friendly you are to the king, the more likely he is to start just piling property that he acquires onto you. <clears throat> because then every time you take a city or a castle or a village or whatever, and he's picking who should be the- who should own it. Oh, fuck. Where? Where are the enemies? Oh, here they come. Uh... The king makes the ultimate decision on that, so if the king likes you a lot, he's more likely to pick you. You can also have other people who really like you vouch for you, but having a good relationship with your king is the best way. <laughs> he's just gonna stand there in his pose screaming a bunch, Walks towards me, instant death. Oh, that's beautiful. Now let me go in the tavern. Come on, where the fuck is a ransom broker? Let's buy some food that they don't already have a bunch of. I'm cool with that. Helps with the morale. I'll vote for the king and he'll like me more. Do quests for your king as much as you can. Doing quests for other lords in your country, even, is often a good idea. That's something I should do more often, is just, when you're a mercenary, they'll give you a lot of quests. Or if you don't work for them, they'll give you a lot of quests. But if you are a vassal just like they are, 
They don't tend to give you a whole lot of quests. You need to speak in private to see what they think of Kings of Realms. Oh, okay, so they need to like me enough to initiate that conversation. Thanks for letting me know. All right, sleep for the rest of the night, the march in the morning. We trained Nord veterans for the king. That's usually a reasonably easy quest once you have enough trainer skill. Or if you're just a high enough level to easily fight tough enemies. Okay, we just, we really need a hit of a ransom broker, or else we're basically losing money on every fight because we can't take more prisoners to sell off. I don't care about that small group of deserters. Rodoks have declared war against the Nords. Okay, that's something for the Nords to divert their attention away from us, so I'm happy with that. Traveler, come on, man. Where's a ransom broker? You need at least 20 in relationship with your king. Because when you leave, you'll get negative 20. Okay, I can do that. Maybe that's how I'll spend the next little while. I'm the same speed as his party. I'd be faster than him if I didn't have these prisoners. And his army's not that impressive. It's tough, but ours is tougher. Mm. You mainly go to the slave trader to sell prisoners? The slave trader gives you a way worse price, though. The slave trader is always in the same spot, but he gives you a price about ten times worse than that of just a ransom broker. All right, I'm not going to catch him before he gets back to his castle, but I will try and come back and catch him off guard when I'm able to move a little faster. See, that's one reason why you tend to want to focus on having a large cavalry army, because you move faster in the field, and that's valuable. Oh, teach me a poem. Thank you. So this is my third poem. Last tip, MDB. I believe if a lord is in a castle or a town, you can ask for them privately. Uh... Usually, if they're around people on the world map or castles, they won't do it, so catch them alone. Okay. Alright, march north. So many bandits! Oh my god! We gotta clean this place up. Are you kidding me? I've never had this bad of luck. Uh, he already has. I already have his poem. I've never had this bad of luck finding a ransom broker. Jesus. I should probably take it to the bandit lair, but it's up by enemy territory. So I don't care that much. Alright, march back. See if we can catch someone off guard. Some soldiers can upgrade. Okay. Farmers... There he is. Same speed. I'm not going to get him. It's same speed. You can still beat them. Uh, as you saw earlier, I actually caught a guy who was going slightly faster than me. Mostly because they make a lot of irresponsible turns. Is the country falling apart or something? No, it's... Uh, that's all Khanite land that we conquered. And the Khanite did a really terrible job of managing their lands. So it was just getting waylaid by bandits. And we never cleaned it up when we took it. Because our country sucks, too. Mm. Alright, we're gonna have to run by Halmar, which is their only city, so they're probably gonna really focus on staying around there. Following a caravan. What a bastard! He's gonna attack our caravan? Would I be able to back up the caravan and beat this guy? We'd have him outnumbered. And he is going to catch that caravan. This guy's got a lot better troops than the caravan, though. It'd be a bit of a risky fight. I'm not going to go for it. Too big of a risk. Caravans are great loot. I'm not attacking caravans. I'm not an asshole. I'm not attacking farmers. I'm not attacking caravans. This is a high honor playthrough. 
No one wants to work for a king that raids innocent peasantry. God, my... My wages have to pay is really high and Mitt none got raided, so I'm not making any money off of it. We need to start making more money. Don't know if it's mods, you can ask caravans to escort them to a gold for town. Um, I do not know. I know that you can escort um, caravans by going through a guild master quest. <coughs> Is there any lord in here? No. You? I'm guessing you're somebody's wife, because it's not a feast. Yep. Not useful. How much honor should you aim for? As much as you can get. You need either really high honor or really low honor uh, to have a positive effect. I go high honor. <sighs> this is an awkward position. What's my honor, out of curiosity? I believe it says under notes. No, is it under camp? No. Report? My honor is 15, which is really good. 30 plus higher is a good start. I agree. If you're going to be like a king, having a lot of honor definitely helps. Because you gotta give people a reason to respect you, and Renown alone isn't gonna cut it. Although my Renown of being 337 is pretty solid. It's like middle upper for your average vassal, but some vassals have like a thousand Renown. It's pretty crazy. I'd say I'm, I'm solidly middle of the pack in terms of Renown in the army that I'm in. Alright, I'm actually going to pick up a few more people just from a village around here. Do you have a quest for me? I'm curious. Not that I'm going to make much money. But if you want me to like train your peasantry or something, I'll do it. Is it you? No. Probably you. Fuck off, I'm not helping you with your cattle. Uh, remember that women have their own personalities too, and because of that, having a high honor against relationship bonus and, and poems also. Yeah, I agree. Or I'm, I'm aware is what I mean to say. Uh, that's why I've been collecting poems and stuff, and my honor is good. I'm gonna go check on Mitnun, see how well it's recovered, because he got raided like a full month ago now. See you, Myrtles. Have fun at school. Fuck, did we just lose land? We just lost a city! God, Mitnun, it's being raided. By how many people? Can I save it? Fuck that guy. I'm saving Mitnun. He's running. Am I faster? I'm faster. I'm kicking this guy's ass. Yeah, turn back towards me. That'll work out well for you. Come on, don't tell me he's faster than me now. He's faster than me now. I'm gonna keep chasing this fucker. I'm gonna keep chasing this fucker until I can't. For a feast. Okay, I'm just not going to the feast. Made peace! <sighs> you bastard. Son of a bitch. I didn't get my revenge. Oh, that sucks. Fuck you guys. I'm going right to your only shitty city that you have left. We could have conquered them so long ago. I'm gonna learn a poem from your city. 
uses time to find lords and talk to them, get friendly with them. That's true. Uh, get back to my land. Gotta be around because we're probably gonna have to defend ourselves because the Nords took our city. Of course, it has to be the one right near where I own a town. So it got raided. Finally, a ransom broker. How did I lose most of my prisoners? I think I got with the random events where they escape if you hold them for too long. I probably missed out on so much money because of that. Fuck. That sucks. Oh, that's brutal. Overnight, they can't have a chance to escape, yeah. Mm. I don't like how much money this is eating up. You, you're somebody. Talk to me. Caravans, okay. Yeah, I took out a Jarl. Uh, who should be made Marshal? Uh, can I convince you to support me? Do you have any idea how much I've done for your shitty fucking country? Wish I had a crossover total war so you could command the country. You can you can command a country. You just get your own country. You can make your own country. Support them. Easy relationship boost. Okay. Um can I support everybody? Uh Hey, communist. If I were to support not him, but somebody that he supports, would that get relationship bonus with both of them? Because that could be good. You get both. That's good. I'll do that. Yeah! Can't support others after you supported one? Okay, I'm fine with it. At least I did something. Okay, upgrade all those recruits right away. I don't need a bunch of unarmored recruits. Alright, how am I doing? Um... Fuck, that had so many towns associated with it. That is rough. We gotta take that back. See if you can speak with someone in private? Okay. Uh, I'll hit up this town, see if anyone's there. Nope. Uh... Let's let's go west. And uh, her marshalship too. Oh, it's the guy I picked. Okay. He'll probably like me more when I go talk to him. Cause he'll have heard I supported him. Anyone in here? No. Looking for my fellow vassals. Oh, this is one of my guys. He's raiding it? I don't like the idea of raiding the villages, dude. But talk to me. Private? I'd rather talk in the open. Uh, do you have, like, a quest for me? You're not happy with your soldiers? I'll do that quest for you. You have already see the lords are in there? Yeah, it's just faster if I just walk in, because then I can just hold the speed up button. Seven Mamelukes? That's a lot. That's expensive, too. Sorry. At least he didn't uh, like me less for it. Actually, do you have any other quests? Nope. Okay. Alright, what's going on in the other villages? Uh, truce expired. That's fine. I hope they declare war on each other. I want the Nords to be distracted with other wars. Hmm. It's the veteran footman that become the horseman, right? Yeah. 
Because I want Mamelukes. Mamelukes are very good. Deserters. Footmen? Oh, fuck it. If they're all footmen, I can outrun them. Yeah. Take them out. Cleaning up my shitty country. You'll regret leaving the army. Ooh. Foggy desert. Is that a phenomenon that happens? Go. Infantry's gonna take a while to get into position. I don't think any of these guys have, like, ranged weapons. Alright, let's do some damage. I don't need to be very careful with these guys. Whoop, that was a miss. They're not quite as, uh... They're not as lame as looters, but they, they could gang up and do some damage. They got decent weapons for fighting people on horseback. Just terrible armor. They're more so meant for fighting bandits. Oh, lost a slave driver, come on. response to every revelation from now on, I do really like that combination of emotes. That's that's why I was so happy when I think it was Metalizer who uh, sent those ones to me and I cropped them out and made them into emotes because they're so perfect. Oh god. They're basically meant to be used in that order. Minutes are ready for upgrade. Or soldiers, whatever. Maybe I'll just go around and take out some bandits for a while. Help make my money back and level up some dudes. While I wait for my army to actually decide to do anything of value. Which, it may be a long wait. What were you even ranting to him to be? I don't know, that's the thing. I don't know where Metalizer got them. It must have been on one of my streams, I guess. I don't know why I'd make a face like that in a vlog. I love it though. It's so funny to me. So many desert bandits up there. I'll fight them. Fuck it. I don't have much time to get in position when I fight these dudes. That's a lot. Okay. Okay. That's like 150 right there. I gotta pick them off a little bit more carefully than that. You, you stay away from these caravans. They help our economy. They're so much faster than me too. This is why it sucks trying to hunt down desert bandits. That was our old marshal, wasn't it? This guy? You're indifferent to me. Task? Nah. He's just telling me to go fight shit. Oh, what's he want? Seven Mamelukes. Sorry, dude, I can't do the Mamelute quest. That is just too much money to drop on making you like me slightly more. How about you? Mittnun has been raided. I don't care. I do not care anymore. Fuck Mittnun. You have no strong opinion of me. Don't want to talk in private. Group of desert bandits have established a hideout in the area. That's exactly what I was looking to do. Thank you. Uh, okay, where are they? Find and destroy it. The quest doesn't say where. I'm gonna guess it's in this area. Uh, come on, not over there. He probably said around what town, I just figured that the quest would also tell me. How wrong I was. Hey, found it! This shouldn't be hard. I have so many heroes that attacking bases like this is pretty easy.
Okay, keep them all following me. This is an all hero team. Sweet. Both Terraria and Paper Mario videos went up at the same time today. Oh, I must have fucked up my scheduling. Um, nothing I can really do about that now. Can't fix it now. Enjoy your early videos, everybody. Actually, before I forget, let me double check to make sure I didn't mess that up on anything else for the week. Found Epic Purple Sword on the WoW server. You're almost level 41 now. Man, you've been leveling like crazy. You've just been soloing? <clears throat> I haven't had time to level that much. Alright, uh, those videos went out. This is scheduled 3 6, 3 6, 3. Okay, yep, uh, I only messed up that one. So looks like everything else is good. Alright, catch up. God, that is a crazy longbow. Oh, thanks for following, uh, Jason. Welcome to the flock. What class are you getting, chat stream? I forget. Alright, some dudes are gonna spawn behind us if we keep killing people while we're right here. So I gotta be careful. Human rogue? Soloing as a rogue can get pretty hard sometimes. I know, because I'm also a rogue and often solo. What version of WoW do you play? You're aware of what version of WoW you play. You're in the WoW chat, and you comment on the videos constantly. You know what version. It's the title of every video that you've watched and commented on. <laughs> Obviously, you know. I've seen people directly answer that to you. All right, I'm just gonna tell my dudes to charge and I'm gonna clean up whatever actually comes at me. It'll be faster. Actually, ah, uh, but I'd get more experience if I did it myself. Fuck it, I'll do it myself. Whoop, well that guy spawned in another guy. Didn't turn out very well for him. I know whoever you think- No, I know for a fact you are. You're the guy who constantly brings up Worgen, and that myself and three other people have told you Worgen are not in the version we play. I know 100% who you are. I don't know if you check your replies. Then again, YouTube recently stopped notifying me of most comment replies I get, which I'm fucking pissed about. Because I pride myself on responding to everybody who messages me. And now YouTube doesn't tell me that people have responded to me most of the time. Which is fucking obnoxious. Great, some of my people got knocked out. Where are they? I haven't got- I've- I'm not even gonna get into this. I've watched people reply to you, myself included, on Discord. Whatever, I'm not getting into it. Is that it? That's it. You can always tell when your people start sharing. An another nice thing about doing this with, uh... Ooh, I really need more food for my army. Another nice thing about doing this with heroes, by the way, you don't need to worry about losing really good troops, where there's like the dice rolling if they die or not. Heroes never die. They can only get wounded and knocked out. All right, so I did the quest. I can turn it in whenever I want. Which, I mean, the sooner the better, but... At least they're not spawning more of them, so we can start whittling them down again. Book merchant. I don't have the money anymore for that. I miss the days when I wasn't at war with the Nords and I could just go north and easily get money fighting uh, Viking raiders. Or sea raiders. Heroes never- oh, isn't Heroes Never Die some Overwatch quote? I'm like the only person on Earth who doesn't play Overwatch. I just- I wasn't that into it when I tried it. It wasn't that interesting to me. I'm sure it's a great game. 
I know it's got like a pro scene and stuff, I'm just not that into it. Is that uh, when Mercy revives people? She says heroes never die, is that it? Because that seems like it makes sense. I know Mercy's the healer and everybody complained about how she got one of her abilities changed recently or something. She had like a mass resurrect move and I think that got changed or something got changed. What seems bad to you, you don't get that? I think it seems like a really good game, I'm just not into it. I think it seems really well made. There are tons of games that I think are really, really good that I just don't like. That I think are like an awesomely made game, but I'm not into. I think that's a really important distinction. Is being able to appreciate a really well-designed game, that's just not my tastes. There are plenty of movies I can say that are like really good, and I just... I it's, It doesn't appeal to me, uh, but I think they're really well made. Not that I'm saying that you, uh, you're bad at that or anything. I'm just saying I think it's a really well-made game. I'm just not into it. Just explaining my thought process. <coughs> I forgot we had so many Serenid Master Archers. Those are actually really good. I'd rather Vegar ones, but honestly, I'm happy with either. They're both really good. God, the whole west side of the country is just a wash. That one city is so valuable. Is our marshal ever going to call for us to fix this? Alright, uh, we need to figure out where Ham is. Um, can you help me improve? No. Damn. Can I win your favor? No. All right, need the location of, uh, where is he? Where is he? I'm always blind and I always miss the person first time. This guy. So he's around here somewhere. Gotta keep an eye on the bandits. I'm sure there's still tons of them. There he is. Let's go cash this in. Well, I leveled, and my horse archer leveled. That's actually a lot of experience. And way more money than I thought I'd get. That's a really lucrative quest. Especially considering it was quite easy. Any more? Yeah, if you ask at a later date. I didn't make him like me much more, actually, which is annoying. Uh, I need someone to capture a noble lord of the kingdom of the Nords and bring him to me. Fuck. That is difficult. I'm gonna say no. It's a total crapshoot on if I'd actually be able to pull that off. Because I, I I need to wait on a good opportunity to come to me for that quest. And I promise nothing. I'm gonna bank that skill point. Uh, it's this dude. Do I need to increase his strength more? I wouldn't mind giving him more power draw, just because it would make his arrows quite a bit stronger. But it's three whole levels to get him to another level of power draw. Whereas horse archery is more important. I'm happy with that. I want to upgrade my dudes, but I'm worried about money. I think I'm going to hold off. been following your channel for a year now. Keep up the great work, man. Thanks, I appreciate it. I, uh, I'm happy that you've been following for a year. Because that probably means I have some kind of entertainment quali entertaining quality to my show. <clears throat> Enough that you could decide to keep watching. Okay, this guy has a decent opinion on me. <sighs> I want to discuss an open. Um, hmm. Events of settings in the realm? No... Uh, task for me? Five main loops. It's not happening. I'm not 
not spending all the money it takes to train Mamelukes for you. Nothing. Damn. I've heard about Roll20, but I don't really know that much about what it is. I, I couldn't tell you if it, if it helps a whole lot. I've heard it's like an online tabletop system or something. But I maybe I heard wrong. I don't know. I've heard it in passing. Uh, farmer, sweet. That's a that's a good quest. Easy quest to befriend some farmers, get some easy experience, help defend a village. That one. I think RP tools is what I've used in the past. I don't remember. It was so long ago that I played online D&D. I miss it. It was fun. Do you have sword sisters in to be the right? Yeah, we got a we got a lot of sword sisters and hired blades. We have five hired blades. We're down to one sword sister because they they are a little bit death happy. <laughs> they they follow me into combat, but their pathfinding is really bad. <clears throat> Where are they? Oh, they're gonna come at me at a really awkward angle. Oh fuck, this sucks. Um, back off. Yeah, we have to fight them at a really awkward angle, where we can't really take the high ground as well. Yeah, we're gonna have to fall all the way back to this hill. It's an awkward position, but it's for the best. Not archers, infantry, 20 paces forward, cavalry, follow me. And we'll see what we can do. <coughs> Let's hope for the best on this. I'm sure we'll survive, I just want to minimize my casualties. Okay, good, they're taking the hill. The archers are starting to get up there. The farmers count as archers and I don't understand why. Oh, you know why they count as archers is because I have my farmers in my army sent to the archer class. I should change that, okay. Because I just want them protected. But you know what? I leveled them up so fast I shouldn't even be concerned. These bandits are almost entirely just low-grade archers. They could still fuck me up if they want to really focus fire on me. So I do need to be a little bit careful. If they start focus firing on me, then I'm going to pull back and start playing more defensively. But until they decide that I'm the threat and not my wall of shields, I'm going to keep killing them. I need to be proactive if I want a lot of experience. I haven't even been hit yet. I did block an arrow, though. Fuck. Nope, missed on that one. Ooh, ah! I thought I got that guy. Is that it? I'm gonna tell the infantry and cavalry to charge at this point because we've almost got it cleared out. I can't believe more dudes aren't trying to run. Is anyone left? Someone must be running over here. Oh no, I think someone's just stuck behind a building. Someone's in a fight over there. You know what? That might be the last of it. <clears throat> yep, that's it. I don't think we had a single casualty. Nice! Not even a farmer died. Only one farmer got knocked out. Refuse it. It's more honor for us. The honor is a lot more valuable to me than anything else. Whoops. Uh... I do not want to buy supplies from the peasants. What am I at? Honor 16. So I got one honor point for that. It's not bad. Where are you from, M to be? Uh, I am from America, as well as my mom is American, and my dad is Turkish. I just want to point out that you spelled I am the exact same way as uh, Ryan did. 
I'm just going to say that once, and then I'm going to say that I'm Canadian. And it's interesting that Turkey was brought up. All right. Did I? I didn't. I didn't get any loot for that <coughs> because you don't get any loot for those kills, which is a shame. Also, knockouts don't count in that. You don't get any of them for like prisoners. All right. Is Canada real? Or is that a lie the media told you? You're right. We're actually just North Minnesota. Uh, <laughs> I love the idea of somebody actually thinking that. I always heard jokes growing up about Americans thinking that Canada is another state. But I'd imagine, like, almost nobody actually thinks that, right? Like, that's gotta just be a joke. Like, I'm sure there's, like, some American kids who haven't learned much about history yet who might think Canada is a state and they've just heard it in passing. I refuse to believe that that is a common misconception in Canada. <laughs> Canada is as real as France, which is just a studio in Poland. I love the idea of that actually being something that somebody thinks. That France is a studio in Poland. There are people who think the Earth is flat, so you never know that's true. Flat Earthers are the craziest shit. And so many celebrities recently came out as flat earthers. What the fuck, man? Shaquille O'Neal just came out recently as a flat earther. Blows my mind. <laughs> what are the chances that a bunch of celebrities genuinely think the earth is flat? Fucking lunatics. Oh. I think I gotta end the stream here, though. Ahem. My throat's getting a little bit wonky. And I got to record that stuff later tonight uh, with Gabe. So I am going to save and exit here. Thank you for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed. Uh, support me on Tad or you can watch some advertisements on your browser or on your phone uh, by clicking the link in the description. Thank you for watching. And until next time, have a nice day.